I am Catherine, and this is my daughter. I am Sapphire, and this is my mother. Um, a family member got ill, so it transformed our life. We went through many changes. Um, we were regular people, and financially, it, it changed our lives. It could be hard sometimes. Like, I've gone to school and not wanted to be there, not wanted to do anything, and just, like, go in the bathroom and cry and not talk to anyone about it and just be by myself. There's nothing that you can really do but just try to get through it and keep your head up. I heard about the Wacom Dispute Resolution Center when I went to a fair at my son's school. My name is Kate McLean. I'm a mediator in training and I'm a professor of psychology at Western. What I would say to a family going through conflict is that it's normal and that all families go through conflict, whether they appear at the DRC or not. And learning how to manage that conflict, deal with that conflict together and maintain those relationships and strengthen those relationships is a real gift to everyone in the family. Me as a parent, I tend to fall back on, oh, well, I've heard that before. And then we get stuck and there's no forward movement. Active listening is one of the biggest things that I had to struggle with personally and learning how to actively li listen to someone and really understand what they're saying to you in the moment and being present to everything that they're saying is really key. Catherine, her partner, and Sapphire were all talking about their relationship and it was clear that the, the tensions were rising and there were some tears and there was there were there were difficult things were being said and it just felt like saying those really difficult things and then each person hearing the other person saying those really difficult things was a moment where okay all that had to get out and it got out and the world didn't end and they were able to keep talking after that i've learned um, the guidelines that we can implement regarding communication um, how to have this open communication where the person feels self-expressed. My proudest moment was with my daughter and to see her willingness to go through a process like that because I think it's not always easy for a teenager to do that and um, I was just proud that she wanted to help me turn everything around and implement um, a more peaceful environment. I'm proud of my mom for a lot of things. I think that she's a very awesome mom and she, we've just been through some crap in our life and the fact that she's still pushing through it and pushes through it with me and my little brother and we get through, we eat and we have a roof over our head. It's very amazing to see that my mom can do that for us. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome.